everybody. It's Bucky with Top Dollar Home Offer. We buy houses, and yes, Tulsa, we help homeowners who say, I need to sell my house fast. How do I do that? If you need cash for your house, give us a call, 918-212-5442. Remember, we buy houses all over Tulsa and the Tulsa Metro, as well as the surrounding areas. If you know anybody that's a homeowner, maybe out of state, that needs to sell their house or wants to sell their house, have them give us a call. We have an ARB program that provides three different options showing you exactly what your home is worth. Today, we're in a continuation of our real estate book that we wrote that's available to download off our website for a small fee, or you can listen to the audio version here for free as we read through it here and talk through what this book's about, right? So the title of the book is Real Estate Investing. This is for those out there that maybe want to get into real estate and not sure how. We just break down. Um, it's a pretty short read book, but we're going to read it through here so you guys can just listen to it. I, I listen to a lot of audio books and I find it beneficial. If sometimes I want to just pick up some knowledge while I'm driving in the car or whatever it may be. We left off. And as we jump into this here, we're going to talk about hiring a inspector. In order for your real estate investment to be profitable, it's a good idea to hire an experienced, qualified inspector for your property you're looking to purchase. Now, why would you do that? Because that's a, you're out of cost. It could cost you two to $300. And you'll have a full detailed report from the inspector. But why? You need to ask yourself, what is your knowledge of real estate? And this really comes to play whether you're experienced in home or construction or maybe have no clue even how to change a light bulb. Hiring an inspector will show you the ins and outs and it's really very beneficial. And I would just suggest if you're getting into the into real estate investing, at least do it once. And the reason why I say to do it once is because then you can use their report to do your own inspections from project to project and house to house that you're looking at. So oftentimes when you're hiring a professional, you can re- create what they're doing and apply it to your next property. So it's kind of like an on the job training. I did this in the past. I went through with an inspector because they like to typically schedule a time with you to get into the property. And when they're there, you can kind of just loaf around behind them and ask them questions. And they'll have a couple different tools that you can pick up, you know, at Home Depot or different places that, sell testing tools such as electrical grounding testing and things like that. But typically what uh, I would do is I would advise you to at least do it once uh, if you haven't experienced it already. And then it helps you learn all the different items that a inspector looks for, right? Uh, they'll be able to advise you whether or not the property is worth buying for real estate investing. So again, that's someone's opinion. If, if you're going to rely on the home inspector, whether you should make it a deal or not, I would go a little deeper because you need to look at the numbers. I mean, he could say, oh, this is a great house. You know, it's got good bones. Well, the numbers don't work for you, then it's not a good deal. You know, don't let anybody talk you into buying your first real estate investment unless the numbers work for you and your goals. An inspector can find things that are usually other people miss. What is that? They can find things that can turn out into a potential larger issue if they're not taken care of, right? Some of those things are electrical issues, plumbing issues, heating items, air conditioning, even ventilation, water. Water, 
water, water, water, water is one of the homes probably, probably the homeowner's biggest cause of problems. You know, water erodes everything. And we have to have water, but it erodes, you know, our foundation. It erodes our roofing shingles. Over time, all those things are typically problems of water. If you get water into the house, it can grow mold. So in electricity, there's so many houses out there that have been miswired or unwired and rewired, and it's not by a professional. So just keep in mind that with the testers, they go around and plug their little tester into each and every outlet so they know if there's anything that's not grounded properly or so forth. They can also make suggestions on general upkeep of the home, including the inside and outside structure, right? I mean, if you walk around homes, and we've, we've talked about this in some of our videos, you know, overhanging tree limbs and branches can, you know, either potentially be future problems for drainage. Uh, they can be problems for you know, debris on the roof or actually the tree falling into the house and causing major problems, even ripping electrical out of the house where the wires come in from the main pole through the weather head. These inspectors are trained to spot problems that you wouldn't even think of. That's why I suggest have one inspector. You know, you can apply that cost to a hundred different houses you buy later, right? But do do one just to see. Even if you don't buy the house, it's still an educational experience so you can learn that and you'll have that detailed home report. So then what do you do? You take that detailed home report and you start using that as a guideline to make sure that you don't have any of these other issues on future houses that you buy. Then when they tell you what's wrong with the home, you can decide if the repairs are done by you or you can change your mind about getting the property, right? Always, always in your real estate contracts, when you do a contract to purchase a property, give yourself an inspection window. That allows you an out because maybe the first time or the second time you look at the house, everything looked fine. But when you come back and you do a deep inspection, you may see something that could cost you thousands and thousands of dollars, right? That's why you always want to have an inspection period when you write your real estate contract. Inspectors can help save you a lot of money when they find things that people don't find when they're going through a property typically. You can consult a real estate agent about hiring an inspector. You can go all over the internet and find ones. Uh, there's many different places. There may they may know several of them that they can recommend, or if you wish, do your own detective work and find one of your own. However, since agents are in the business, it may be better for you to get a recommendation from them. It would also be quicker. And just Google it, look for reviews, figure out who's the highest reviewed, use them. If you don't like him, pick another one. The inspector should thoroughly check the property inside and outside. They should also think about what results you want from the inspection. They may ask questions to see what you're missing about the process. Having an inspector checking your potential property investment is very important. They'll be able to advise you of the condition of the home and whether or not it's worth purchasing from their perspective on repairs. In their opinion, they're an independent party, so they recommend their recommendations are usually worth their weight in gold, right? However, before you sign on the dotted line, go over everything with the inspector. They will explain in detail all of their findings from the property inspection, and then you will have to decide if it's something worth investing in. Okay, guys, remember, we buy houses. We buy houses, Tulsa. If you own a house and you are saying, I need to sell my house fast or cash, then give us a call. We just discussed the importance of using a home inspector at least once in your career. If not, you're taking some chances. Getting a good understanding of what a home inspector can do for you could save you thousands of dollars. You may have a great deal on paper, but when the inspector gets in there and finds things that you didn't see, 
you may realize, hey, I need to back out of this deal. And that's okay. Don't stress. Give us a call, 918-212-5442. We buy houses.